Right, thanks for joining me once again. Today we have this, which has been a bit of a pain trying to get hold of. I've wanted one for a long time. And, well, let's just say some websites have said they've got it and they haven't. Just telling porky pies. That's the inner box, iOS version. Tab here, magnetic. Right, open that like that. Let's see. Oh, there we go. It's not the pro version as much as I would have liked to have had the pro version. Bit of a random set up there. Thank you. Please read and take note. So certification stuff. And a quick start guide. And there we go. Now some of the pictures you looks like it's black it's it is printed on so there's the other side it looks rubberized but it's I don't think it is cover that not I don't know whether there's anything important there but oh, auto focus, five volts, one point zero amp, uh, zero seven amps. But this, this thing, oh, it moves it up and down, only very slightly. Well, slowly, it takes lots of turns to move it up and down. But there's that bit. Here we have, looks like a USB-C, yeah, a USB-C cable. Nice and long. Nothing else in there. Oh, our pouch. With a flare, a flare. I'm surprised there's not a belt clip on this. Not sure what that is. <coughs> yeah, I'm surprised there's not a belt clip. And there we stick our camera. That someone's at my door. But somebody else will get that. Still using the ring as you can hear. There's the USB cable, and that pops into there. So then, there's everything we need. Voila. Nothing else in there. I was surprised. Not that I was expecting anything else, but surprised there's not more stuff. <coughs> so. There we have our FLIR 1, third generation. Where's the other box? I'm going to have a play with that later. I'm going to charge it first. But hopefully you've enjoyed this. Not very many videos of this particular version. Not that I've seen. Um, there's the odd ones. Most of them are for the Pro, because the Pro one seems to have came out earlier than this one. Not sure why, because this is the more... Everybody's going to buy this sort, really, because it's the cheaper one. So there's going to be more people that are going to buy this one than the Pro version. Not entirely sure what the difference is. Obviously there will be some. Um, hopefully not too many. 
but this one is just over £200. Um, the pro version is near a four, so it is twice the price almost. But hopefully, you've enjoyed this video. Hopefully, if you're planning on buying one, you like the look of it and you think, oh, I may as well get one of those, especially at the price, because it's, it's just a toy. That's all I've got it for. But thanks for watching. Please hit subscribe, thumbs up, and join me next time for something else. Thanks again. Bye for now.